trying to make my comeback, play for a good college. Um, I want to play overseas. That's going to be a hard goal to hit. I'm going to be working extra hard all the time. A lot of key components I need to add into my game. I know I'm not perfect. I'm trying to become as perfect as I, as I can. Because I'm only going to go forward. That's my goal. And I'm not going to stop. I'm not going to be at par. I'm going to keep moving forward. Two years ago, I was getting ready to head to Cabrillo. I was working on my game all the time. I was trying to win a state championship. Um, just trying to get my mind right, just to be, to be able to play at the next level, you know, because guys are physical, they're bigger, they're better. Um, it's pretty much just a whole other level. Yeah, I mean, I'd say that I wasn't nearly as good as I am now. Um, I think I've improved tremendously in many aspects of the game. You know, just growing as an individual and all those aspects. Count, you know, countless hours of working on my body, my physique. Um, I thought that if I don't have the physique to go along with my game, you're not going to be wanted at the next level because you can't compete. Watching videos of you know what I need to do, um, you know, guys have helped me along the way as well. Uh, a lot of friends have helped me. Uh, I mean, just plenty of plenty of resources that have helped me. Um, you know, I think that that's been a good one. Um, also, working on my game specifically, my three-point shot. Um, I put hours and hours on that. My ball handling. You know, becoming a true point guard. I still have a lot of work to do um, in regards to becoming a true point guard, but plenty of plenty of work that I put in. In regards to 2018 season, um, it went. It was a little shortcoming. Uh, we didn't we didn't go as far as we'd like, um, especially not me because I wanted to win the state championship, and I believe we could. We have the team for it. Um, I'd say we came up short, unfortunately, but um, it was a fun season. Uh, got coached by James Page, got coached by Tony Markopoulos. Those, those two coaches together are uh, great coaches. and you know, They brought out the best in me as a junior college athlete. And I think that they really brought out this new part of my game that you know, I didn't know I had. I, did, yeah, I was the MVP of the South Coast Conference. Coast South Conference, sorry. Um, first team all state. Um, you know, it's an amazing feeling. Um, there's nothing like it. Um, I've been working very, very hard for it, so I thought that I should, I, w I was the one to get it anyway. It was a great award. Um, I thought it was well deserved with the amount of work that I put in. Um, I'm in the talks with a lot of colleges, Division One, Division Two. I'm taking it day by day. I don't, I don't have a destination, but I would like to go out of state. I just have a lot of um, a lot of things to settle with these coaches and a lot of things to look into. You know, I, I just I don't want to jump into the first um, coach that says, you know, we'll sign you full ride scholarship. You know, I, I just don't want to jump into the boat like that. I want to make sure it's a perfect fit. It's uh, where I want to go for the next two years of my college career, so that after that I can play professionally. Um, you know, I want of course my ultimate goal is to win and um, win a state championship. I really want to win a state championship. That's my ultimate goal. So, where do you sell, where do you see yourself in two years, in an ideal scenario? I see myself just coming off of a state title, and whether it's Division One or Division Two, uh, national championship. Um, I don't think I can see it any other way. I don't envision it any other way. Uh, wherever I go, those in, in the next two years, it will be in a state championship game, and I will have another MVP season. Because my game has, again, evolved from what it's at now to the even next level. Um, and I'll be preparing to play overseas.